All right, Shalom, I'm giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bah Hashem, Yahweh Shah, Bah Hashem, Rekha Kodash. I want to give double honor to the elder apostles of Great Millstone, and Shalom, I'm a salute to the hopefully elect. So this is a video that I found on uh, the channel 60 Minutes, right? And the first uh, thought that I had when I saw this video, the first thing that came to my mind, Right, it says fentanyl fueling worst drug crisis in the U.S. history, kill, killing 70,000 a year. That's a lot of people. Now, um, I, I, I was thinking to myself, uh, I grew up doing a crack academic, you know, during the uh, early 80s. Well, late, I, I was a kid, right? So, back then. It wasn't a drug. It was. It, they didn't call it a crisis, right? They. They. It was a war on drugs, and they was treating Jake like they were uh, zombies or non-human. You know, Jake uh, uh, get uh, have like one pill, and they'll give him fifty years. You know, I'm exaggerating a little bit, but yeah, it. That Jake will get caught with a little bit of substance. Um. Because during the 80s, Jake was going through hard times. You know, you had um, you had some Jake doing good, of course. But for the most part, Jake was struggling, you know, as far as the, uh, the work field. So, um, you know, Jake was trying to uh, look for a way to escape reality. Now, I'm not um, making an excuse, you know, for these Jakes. But you got to call it how, how you see it. it. They ain't had no mercy. I just did a video. My last video was saying that they, they didn't. Esau ain't had no mercy on Jake. man. But now that is. Because uh, ultimately the elites are in control of all this. Ultimately the Lord. All right. That's what I meant. Ultimately it's the Lord. But uh, as we look at Job 9 and 24, the earth was given into the hands of the wicked. He allowed these devils to move how they move. So now that is um, targeting the more, more for, for the most part, the white communities, black too, because if you if you do the research, right, look how many Jakes that, that passed from this fentanyl thing. Um, um, what's that guy name? Um, just the name of fruit, uh, famous ones, uh, Rich Homie Quan, that rapper, uh, the girl from Three Six Mafia, um, DMX, um, the list. It's a lot. I mean, that passed from a fit no, uh, allegedly, so to say, or what they would say, an overdose. So, but it's mainly affecting these people in the rural areas. In these Edomite areas, some of them, are, some of them are Jake, but for the most part, it's, it's in a they, it's in a white, so-called white neighborhoods, and a lot of these people are dropping dead. I did a video maybe a couple uh, years ago that this this the cop this cop daughter had died from this uh, uh, fentanyl, uh, what they would call crisis. But back then, when they was flooding the uh, United States with all type, all matter of drugs, coke, heroin, um, everything, from dope. And Jake was indulging. They were targeting Jake, trying to trying to throw the book at Jake. Cops raiding houses, beating up Jake, shooting Jake. You know, no type of mercy. But now that white people are are, are all drugged up. Now it's a crisis. So that's that's. The, the most part I wanted to just show the hypocrisy of this place so let's play a little bit of any video fair use right I got this one 60 minutes I just came across this video so I said I, I don't want to turn I want to go ahead and play it while I, while I got it while it's fresh on my mind so I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and play a little bit of it we are in the midst of the worst drug crisis in US history the drug is fentanyl, and unlike cocaine and heroin, it's a purely chemical, man-made drug. 
It's cheap to produce, easily smuggled, and packs an incredibly addictive punch, 50 times more powerful than heroin. Nearly all the fentanyl flooding into the U.S. is made in Mexico by two powerful drug cartels with chemicals primarily purchased from China. And as you're about to hear, it is frequently hidden in counterfeit pills made to look just like prescription drugs. It's the scourge of our time. Last year, more than 70,000. And that's how a lot of people are dying because you got these uh, uh, guys that think they're chemists, right? Just because they know how to cook up crap right? or, or whatever. They think they call them street pharmacists. So they want to make their uh, uh, so-called um, product stronger. They, pit and they, they don't realize that this, this fentanyl stuff is made for animals like horses and stuff. So a human body, you put that in a human body, your heart is stopping immediately. If you don't have any, I think, it, I believe it's called Narcan, to adverse that effect, um, to adverse that effect, you, you're out of here, you know? You're gone, you're out of here, you're, you're, you're gone, you know? And a lot of people had, had died from this uh, fentanyl thing. A lot of white people. A lot of, lot of, it's in the entertainment because in the entertainment world, you got a lot of Jake that's doing into drugs because they want to stay up. A lot of them want to stay up. They want to get high. They want to party. So they come across a bad pill. And these dope dealers, they um, believe they're, they're, they're themselves a chemist, which they are not. And they're not doing a proper proceed, proceed, procedures and to, um, know how how much doses are in in these pills or in you know so they go ahead and sell it and 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 uh you know death is that an alarming rate people are dropping dead because the this stuff is too strong you know they said it's 10 fit what do you say 50 times stronger than heroin you know so a human body uh the consumption can handle all that you know let's go ahead oh that's i just wanted to uh re re uh iterate that thousand americans died from fentanyl that's a higher death toll than u.s military casualties in vietnam iraq and afghanistan combined did you hear what you just said let's let me go back man that's a lot so a lot of people are dying more than a war. Oh. The scourge of our time. Last year, more than 70,000 Americans died from fentanyl. That's a higher death toll than U.S. military casualties in Vietnam, Iraq, and Afghanistan combined. Wow. So but ultimately, I want to prove to you that this is the Lord operating and that's why we are uh, telling you that the Lord, right now he has mercy, but soon the, the doors of mercy is going to close because he's the one that's controlling it. I'll prove it. Let's go ahead and get the scriptures. All right, so uh, the scriptures that I got, one of my favorite scriptures is 1 Samuel 2 and 6. It says, the Lord killeth and maketh alive. He bringeth down to the grave and bringeth up. So it's the Lord doing it. Satan can't do this. Satan is not in control of this uh, so-called crisis. All right. But I want to get another scripture, right? Uh, Proverbs 1, I believe it's around 26. Is it 26? Um, I'll start at, oh, oh, you know what? I'll start at 22. This is Proverbs chapter 1, verse 22. It says, how long, you simple ones, will you love simplicity? Yeah, how long, Jake, will you love this simple-minded way of living? Black culture. Uh, listening to uh, Cardi, what is it? Uh, what's the new, Sexy Red. The whole life, the 304 life, the stripper world. Getting money. Uh, gang banking. Um, you got a lot of smoke. Uh, for other black men but when it comes to other other races you, you you quiet or you 
You want to resolve things now. You want to talk things out. You got all the smoke for your own brother. But look at that uh, simple one. Look at how simple that nigga was on the stand um, in a young Dolph case. When I was listening to him, I was just like, God damn. The Lord is something, boy. The Lord is something for for that simple-minded dude. $800 to, to take out someone. Now you got to live the rest of your life behind bars. Was it worth it? You know? And then you shot down another black man like he was a dub. Like, less than a dub. You know? Living in this system. I think you probably would have got more time if you would have did a dub like that. The way these devils, you know, they treat, they love these animals, but they treat the animal damn near better than Jake. But for you to you for you to have that no remorse like that, man. I looked at the tape. I was just like, man, that's I believe Elder Apostle Tahar uh, and Elder Karasibo. I believe they did a video on that as well. On that uh, the young Dolph, the the, the murderers of uh, that rapper. So, our people are simple, man. Now them two guys, they got to spend the rest of their life in jail. And uh, another, uh, Jake is dead right now, but he's in the spirit world. So it says, how long, you simple ones, will you love simplicity? And the scorers delight in their scorning and fools hate knowledge. Yeah, you y'all, you hate the knowledge that we give you. We see y'all. We out there on the highways and byways. We see y'all walking past. Don't think they won't see y'all. But ultimately, it's not about us. It's not about what we see. The angels, that's the Heavenly Father's eyes. The angels out there seen walk past the Lord's word. It says, turn you at my reproof. Behold, I will pour out my spirit unto you and I will make known my words unto you. So the elect going to listen. The elect one hate these videos out. But not the um the non-elect. It says, but I have called and you have refused. I have here go. This is this here it is right here. I have stretched out my hand and no man regardeth. And how is the Lord stretching out his hand? Through his men, through the prophets. Us out there on the highways and byways doing this this work, telling you that you're an Israelite, telling that to you repent. Telling you to come out your ways. Telling you to follow the law, statutes, and the command. Telling you to put down that pork. Telling you to stop listening to that fat, that fat, uh, big head, uh, pork smell, uh, pork sweating preacher. The TDJs. The what's the other one name? Uh, Bishop Eddie Long, which I believe he passed. You got that. Uh, Simple-minded um, African uh, preacher. It look, I believe it looked like they were Africa. He throwing fireballs at people, and uh, that shit was hilarious. <laughs> he throwing. <laughs> you people are simple. <laughs> Let me find it. Hold on. Let me see. If I can find. It. Yeah, here it is. This is the video that I <laughs> I got it from Ra uh, Ra. Rawa uh La Yasha Allah uh Yahabasha uh four oh five six. This is his uh video. Let's go ahead and play it. Huh? Nothing. Zero. Zero. How much do you have? I will uh and I have one point two. One point two. Yes. Give me all of it. Okay, thank you, bro. Eh? I'll do the translation. Now wait, I'll tell you why. Yeah, yes. Because I saw you in the spirit. Oh yes, yes. God taught me all the money that you have left. Give it to me. I'll do that. I'll do that now. In a few weeks. Oh, yes. You'll be shocked. I'll do that. Yes. Do you have money? <laughs> Hold on. I got this. I'm looking for the other one, actually, when he threw the fireball. Hold on. Here go one part. I'm going to play this. But this wasn't the one I was looking for. This is hilarious. Look at all this, man. It was the... Uh, the African past. That shit was so crazy. Uh, let's go. Pastors, are you ready? You want something? Take it! That's yours tonight. You want it? You want it? Take it! You want it tonight? Take it! The power of the Holy Ghost! Take it! Holy Ghost! 
Here it is. This, uh, I'm going to play this. Fair use. This is crazy, man. This hey. This is here. Hello. Yes. Did you see that? <laughs> play it again. This Oh man. Let's go back to the uh amphetamine or heroin. They make it into these fake pills that look identical to pharmaceutical drugs that Americans would recognize, like Oxy or Xanax, Percocet, Adderall. It will be a very massive high that is very short. And that person, they're betting, if they survive, will come back again and again and again to buy more. Three years ago. So there you go. Um, yeah, so it's a, it's a dirty game out here. But the Lord, the Lord is stretching out his hand. So uh, I hope this was edifying to the body. Till again, Shalom.